Intersection of lines. Let P be the point of intersection of the lines 3x plus 4y equal to 2a. You know, like this 2a. 7x plus 2y equal to 2018. Large number. And Q be the point of intersection of the line 3x plus 4y is 2018. And 5x plus 3y equal to 1. The line through P and Q has a slope of 2. The value of A is. And so, first thing to notice that we can find Q. We can locate Q somewhere. And then, we know that through Q and P, the line has a slope of 2. Using that, we can find A. So that's the idea. Q we can find. That's the point of intersection of these two lines. So we can locate Q. And then we can get P in terms of A. And then use the idea that PQ has a slope of 2. Or something along those lines. First up, I'm going to find point Q. Right? So it's a very time consuming question. It's a tricky question. I look, I tried to get a lot of uh, juicier approaches for this, but the old-fashioned one is probably the best. Right? 5x plus 3y equals 1. We do. We can multiply this by 5 and this by 3 and locate x comma y. Then the 15x plus 20y is 5 times 2018, which is 10,090. 15x plus 9y equals 3. Brilliant. 15x plus 20y is 10,090. 15x plus 9y equal to 3. Subtract 1 from the other. We get 11y equals 10087. 1 plus 0 plus 7 is 8. 0 plus 8 is 8. It's a multiple of 11, thankfully. So we can find y. Y is 10087 divided by 11. It was 9 times. 99, 1 times 11, 7 times. Y is 970. 5x plus 3y is 1. 5x plus 3 into 970. 3 7 are 21. 1, 2, 3 plus 2, 5. 2, 7, 5, 1 equals 1. Or 5x equals minus 2, 7, 5, 0 x equals divide this by 5 minus 550 or q is the point minus 550 comma 970 quite brilliant and now we can find p similarly in terms of q and then find this but we know that pq has a slope of 2 we can take a slightly different approach form equation of pq how do we know that? We know a slope, we know a point. We can say y minus y1 is m times x minus x1 or y minus 917 is 2 times x plus 550. And so this is the equation of PQ. So P should lie on it. The point of intersection of these two points should lie on this line. R, the three lines are all concurrent. All three lines pass through P. These two lines meet at P. This line passes through P. Or the three lines that we have. 3x plus 4y equal to 2a. 7x plus 2y equal to 2018. And this line. They all pass through P. Okay. So if we solve this and this. We will get P. Substitute the points of x and y here. We will get A. Brilliant. So let's find this equation. Y minus 917 is 2x plus 1100. Or 2x minus y, take this y this side, this minus 917 minus 1000 or 17 and plus 110, 0, 01 minus 2017. Right? Brilliant. Now we need to solve for 7x plus 2y equals 2018 and 2x minus y equals minus 2017. And then get values of x and y, which will be the coordinates of P. Substitute that x and y, which is maybe x1, y1, the solution of this, into this expression. And then find A. Whew, time consuming. Right? Now comes the juicier, softer, wonderful bit. We have to go in to find x and y. Get the values of x and y and plug this into this. 
is there a way of manipulating these two expressions to get 3x plus 4y to get 3x we can multiply this by 2 and subtract to multiply this by 2 we'll have minus 2y we subtract you'll get 4y or brilliant we multiply this equation by 2 you get 4 4x minus 2y is minus 4034 now forget this subtract this from this you'll get 3x plus 4y equals 2018 minus minus 4034 this is 2a 2a equals 252 6052 or a is 3026 wonderful question delightful question but very tough more than tough there's magically there's nothing magically difficult conceptually here but very very time consuming the coordinate geometry questions are going to be time consuming this one particularly so